Hi folks, welcome to 3 Minute Thursdays. My name is Ronnie Collins and each Thursday I take a question that someone asks about scripture, about God, about the Bible and try to answer that. Uh, being Thanksgiving week, a uh, question that came is did Paul in 1 Thessalonians chapter 5 really tell us to be thankful for everything? Well, let's look and see what it says. In 1 Thessalonians chapter 5, uh, starting in verse 16, it says, Always be joyful, never stop praying, be thankful in all circumstances. There's a difference in being thankful in and being thankful for. And Paul says be thankful in all circumstances. Not to be thankful for the bad things that happen to us. That would be crazy. That would be ludicrous. Uh, but what, if you go back and look at the context of 1 Thessalonians chapter 5, Paul is addressing the fact that Jesus is going to return and make all things right and that uh, in light of that, that Christians need to live differently. We are we're to have a different attitude, a different perspective than those who have no hope. As a matter of fact, he, he says in verse 14, we urge you uh, to warn those who are lazy, encourage those who are tim timid, and take care of those who are weak. Uh, don't repay evil for evil. And then he goes on to say, uh, never stop praying, always be joyful, always be thankful. Folks, he's talking about having an attitude of thankfulness and being uh, that time of year, Thanksgiving. It is my prayer that uh, we can sit down with our family or if we're by ourselves, we can sit down and write out the things that we're thankful for. No matter what the situation is, there is always something to be thankful for. We are blessed uh, beyond measure. Um, one of the things that uh, I tell my congregation all the time is that even in bad circumstances, God is making us and molding us who he wants us to be. Not that God causes bad things to happen. Those are consequences. They're, they're the effects of a fallen world, living in a fallen world. God never causes us bad things to happen to us necessarily, but God absolutely allows things to happen to us because the world has been set in motion and he never promised to take us out of those situations, but to walk through those situations with us. Hope you have a great week. Be sure and send in the questions that you have about scripture, questions that you've always wanted to know the answers to. Have an awesome week.